Flames hosting the Senators, and the Senators are plus 165 on the money line. The Flames are minus 200. The over-under is 6.5 goals. The Senators getting a goal and a half are minus 154 on the puck line, while the Flames laying a goal and a half on the puck line are plus 135. Both of these teams lost the last game that they played. Before you bet on this game, go to a site like VegasInsider.com. It'll allow you to compare all the casino's pricings in one place, whether you bet online or in person. And then go to a site like Covers.com. You can compare how these teams have done individually, head-to-head, home away money line puck line over unders it's a very useful tool and it's totally free head to head the home team is six and four in their last 10 games the senators have won the last two games that they played against the flames the senators are seven and three against the flames in their last 10. the underdog has won the last two games the underdog is seven and three on the money line the underdog getting a goal and a half on the puck line is seven and three there have been three one goal games in their last 10 including the last game that they played against each other the over-under is 4-4-2 four, four, and two in their last 10 meetings, and the under 6.5 goals is 6-4 and four in their last 10. The last game they played, the Senators beat the Flames 4-3 in overtime. The game before that, the Senators beat the Flames 4-1 in Calgary. The game before that, Calgary beat the Senators 4-0 in Ottawa, and the game before that, they beat them 6-1 in Calgary. Now, in their last handful of games overall, the Senators are 6-4 in their last 10. The last two games that they've played have gone over, and the over is 7-3 in their last 10. We've had 7 goals, 9 goals, 5 goals, and 7 goals. The Senators have these stretches where they score 5-plus goals. So they've scored 5 goals or more in 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, in 6 out of their last 10 games. And a couple of those games, they were shut out, so it's sort of like hit or miss with what version of this team you're going to get. Now, for the Flames, they're 3-7 and seven in their last 10. The last two games that they've played have gone under. The over-under is 5-5 five and five in their last 10. We've had four, four goals, one goal, nine goals, and three goals. The Flames have scored one goal or fewer in three out of their last four games. The Senators own the Flames. They've been scoring a little bit more consistently. So I'm going to take the Senators with the money line. I'm going to take the Senators getting the goals. And I'm going to go under. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut and please bet responsibly.